Hello friends, family, and fans, I'm Harder D. We are back playing Dark Souls. Um, so we're just right back here where we died because the guy kept using lava attacks. And I was gonna go back for a rematch and kick his butt, but then I remembered, oh yeah, forgot. NPCs don't appear if you're not, um, if you're not, uh, non-hollow, I guess? Or human, I guess it's called human. So sadly, we can't even re-summon him until we run back here and re-liven ourselves. Lame. That's one thing I don't like about Dark Souls. Is that to get, like, the NPC battles, you always have to be, um, you always have to be alive. And it's all like, ugh, I don't want to do that anymore. Just make that stop. Like, just let me, you know, battle stuff and no matter what state I'm in. There we go, we're alive again, so that way we can have round two with that stupid king guy. Boop. There we go. You always want to kill these guys, because otherwise they will follow you. There we go, now we're coming back to round two, and this time I'm not going to let him even get up. You know, spell in edgewise. Alright, kill these guys. This guy. Bonk. Slash. Bonk. Slash. Oh, double slash. Alrighty, now we just need him to arrive. So I think if we go over here, he'll be summoned. Hello, stupid king guy. Come on, just get summoned. I don't have time for this. Oh, there he is. Like I said, this time we're bringing the fight to him. On more even ground, too. <laughs> In this case, literally. There we go. Now we're kicking his ass. Mmm. Praise the sun, bitch. Praise it. That's what you get for being a super dick. Oh, you have to knock a foot from him. There we go. Well, oh, that was simple. Alrighty, so... Oh, yeah, I forgot these guys exist again. Uh, the only problem about dying is that everything comes back. Alright, so we're going to go over this direction. We're going to, you know, kill a few guys. Whoop! You're dead. You're... Hey, you're supposed to be dead. You're supposed to be dead! Am I not? <laughs> there we go, get these guys. And there's an archer. Oh, do I hate archers. There we go, so we Knight. There we go, you want to drop that thing down. You know, come along this way. Where does this go? Oh yeah, this is the other direction you can go in here. Alright, because yeah, there's the sewer system. Oh, this is an easy way of dying. Make sure you have a really good shield. Because, guess what they hit in the dark? Stupid bone wheels. And because it's dark, guess what you can't do? You can't target them unless they're right up your butt. So you always want to make sure you're super careful. Keep your shield up the whole time. Otherwise, they will just smash you. Oh, like that. There we go, there we go. Think, think we're good? Think we're good? Are you dead? Are you dead? Hard to tell. Alright. Chuck some cherry juice. Yum, 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 yum. See, if you don't know how to... If you don't know about this, or... Oh, jeez. Like, down here is actually how you have to get through the level. And if you don't know about it, guess what? You're just going to be trapped in this area forever. Like, say goodbye to your friends and family. You're now you're now a painting person. Alright, where'd the other guy go? I know you're in here. Oh, there you are. Can you, uh, can you stop spinning? There you go. There you go. Just accept some death. So, yeah, you want to be making sure that you're always walking around. Make sure you trigger all the enemies. Because the last thing you need is to be able to do start doing something, and then they just backstab you. There we go. This is what you need to look for. And as you can see, it's wonderfully like, it looks like everything else. So if you don't know that it's there, then you can royally screw yourself. And like I said, you can't teleport out of this area. 
Oh, that's not creepy as all hell. Ooh. Mm, excuse me. It's getting a little bit late for me, but, you know, I do what I do. There we go. Now, additionally to that, oh, this looks suspicious. Who would have thought? Oh, look at that. It's an empty, yeah. Uh, I mean, it's a hollow wall. Now, the worst part is there's also wheel guys back here. And it sucks because you are in a very confined space. So unless you can kill them super quick, then they can easily kill you really quickly. Oh yeah, and if you come up here, there's... Ugh, jeez, go away, no one likes you. There we go. This guy drops Fire Surge. A wonderful pyromancy. I've never used it, but pretty much it's like a flamethrower attack. But yeah, you can get that from over here. So I'm just going to walk around a bit, see if we can find anything. Nope. Right, let's try in here. Oh, I do not like this, because I know that they're around any corner. See? Told you. Around every corner. Okay, no one behind me. Ooh, the annex key. That's also important if you want to get more exploration in this area done. Which is actually quite a few good things, so, I mean, you pretty much want to. And then we can go this way. Oh, look, another bone skeleton wheel. Get back over here so I can kill you. Mm, yeah! That's how I like it. You being dead. nothing's over here and then if we take this route we just climb up here and come out of a well oh geez there's guys here why why are you just hanging out here that's rude Ugh. these guys are like leeches they're just everywhere oh, those are humanity very nice Alright, so let's avoid the weird leech people. And before we go down that main area, we're actually going to head over here. Make sure to destroy benches. Just in case. I think just in case. And here's where we use the annex key. Alrighty. Yeah, there's some pretty good stuff in this area. Like, um, there's... This guy. Obviously. There we go. Make sure to flee from him. There we go. Okay. So let's head off in this direction. Hey, I need you guys to come up here. Yeah, you with the fireball. I don't want to deal with you while you're down there. I'm not coming to get you. Come on. What? Oh, he like fell down. What a loser. Really? You're just gonna sit there the whole time and blow fireballs at me? Hey, buddy. Whoop. And back away. What if I can beat this guy at his own game? Ah, oh, you and your stupid inability of throwing over a wall. Oh, all right, let's go the hard way. Whoop! Oh, so I'm dead. Whoop! There we go. So you're gonna want to come over here. Here's the dark ember, and oh, hey birds, how's it going? Um, I'd rather not deal with you right now. There we go. Like I said, you definitely don't want them jumping on your head. If you bring them up here, it's a little easier. There we go. There we go. Don't worry, I'm coming back for you. You're a cool bird enemy, though. I do like that. Like, I do like the uh, idea of, like, mixing crow and human together. Is that it? What am I hearing? Oh, I'm hearing that guy. Wow, that guy, that was a long distance one. Oh yeah, I forgot. Boop. You can smash this open, and this leads to an item. 
Zoink! Velka's Rapier. I think that's pretty good. I can't exactly remember. But if you remember that, uh, the partner guy, uh, he's also about Velka. So that's kind of like her rapier, so. Well, then we're gonna come up here, and we're gonna grab the Vow of Silence. Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Oh, come on, really, two of you guys? Uh, excuse me, I need to, I need to go down here, thank you. And then I'm just gonna take a drink, and walk around this hole. You know what, in fact, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna walk this way, thank you. It was nice seeing you, but, uh, I'd rather not die. See, you can just walk around right here, and then there's this. Boop. We're just gonna continue walking away from them, because I just don't feel like putting up with them. There we go. See, it's that simple. Just walk away and avoid all your problems, and you never have to deal with them. As long as you keep walking, because there's always a catch-up. Alright, so. Here's the final bridge. There's a few extra areas in this place that I haven't explored, but... Well, for the most part, you guys got the bi you guys got uh, the biggest stuff. There we go. Make sure to defeat these guys. They hide. In, they love to hide in the nice little nooks and crannies. See? Oh, come on. There we go. Two, one, and take another. Oh, hey, big guy. What's up? That is a big shield. I think he's wearing the Dark Knight set. I mean, the Black Iron set. I've never actually put on that helmet, but... The, uh... The armor looks familiar. And that's how you easily die. <laughs> oh, man, this is... This is fun. I really enjoy Dark Souls 1. And Dark Souls 2. I really do actually enjoy that. All right, here's the boss fog. Oh, hello there. Miss Boss, that's not attacking me. Why, hello there. Who art thou? One of us thou art not. I'm Poopin' Noggin. If thou hast misstepped into this world, plunge down from the plank and hurry home. If thou seekest I, thine desires shall be requited not. So, this is Priscilla. Oh, look, her little feet. She's not wearing shoes. She's actually a half-dragon. She's got this gorgeous, floofy tail. Oh, you got a floofy tail. You got a floofy tail. Uh, yeah, as you can see, she's currently wielding a big scythe. She's a big person. And uh, I feel bad for doing this, but uh, yeah, I want... As much from ah, what your Why tail? Alright, so she's a little hard, because guess what? She turns invisible. So what you gotta do is you gotta watch for her footprints as such. And then... Wait, are those my footprints? I can't tell. That's the problem. I can't tell what my footprints are and hers. Oh, oh, we got her. Hey, Priscilla. Don't mind me, just slicing away at ya. Why are you back to being visible? I didn't know I could turn you back visible. <sighs> Sorry about that. But why? What secrets? Sorry, Priscilla. Heart girl, I love ya. Here's what here's a praise the sun, you know. Praise the sun, everybody. Praise the sun for Priscilla. Sorry, but you were just a boss. And no boss is safe from me. So now if you guys are wondering how to leave this world, she actually was telling the truth. If you actually don't want to defeat her. You literally just walk to the edge here, as you can see, this is the one from the cutscene. And, uh, yep, you plunge to your death. <laughs> so we're just gonna have a little peek here, and, uh, and, uh, whoop! And down we go! Whee! Alright, cool, cool. And homeward bone, and we're outside of the painting! And that is how you... Oh, jeez, I have to deal with this guy first. And that's how you uh, complete the um, painting of Arianus. It's a, like I said, it's a fun level. It's got a passive boss who actually isn't aggressive. Speaking about aggressive, this guy needs to die. Okay, come on. There you go. There you go. 
But that is all the time we have left. We're going to have to continue this on next time. So until then, you guys have a simple, wonderful evening. Bye-bye!